not the suspect. Right now, the only lead the Madison County Sheriff's Office has is that the suspect is driving a black pickup truck. Deputies say one man stole thousands of dollars worth of equipment from one house and stole other items from several others on or around Kill Mountain. I feel like, okay, I'm not safe in my, on my own piece of land. Somebody else is just going to walk and take it. Judy Gotze was in shock when she found out someone stole equipment from her barn on Shooting Star Trail. She said a generator, air compressor, and power tools were some of the items stolen. It's things that my husband works with uh, daily, sometimes weekly. It's things he makes a living with. Gotze said she was awakened just after midnight last Thursday. That's when she saw someone with a flashlight in her barn. Gotze didn't get a good description of the suspect, but said the person left in a black truck. She called police and filed a police report, but now she's concerned with replacing what was stolen. No, we don't have the money. We don't even have the money to say to go out and replace one of the saws this week. According to the sheriff's office, around four other burglaries occurred in the same area and the victims described the same vehicle. Now, Godsey says she plans to create a neighborhood watch. Sure, the cops would rather get a phone call saying, I think something's going on until it's too late. The sheriff's office encourages you to call 911 if you see anything suspicious. Godsey is looking to form two neighborhood watches, one for the bottom of the mountain and the other one for the top of the mountain. Reporting in Madison County, Alexis Scott, Way 31 News.